Hello everybody, it's me, Pred, and we are back with Fallout 2. So it seems like I'm releasing uh, one part a day at the moment, instead of uh, one part every two days. That's because uh, Barani has um, uh, some scheduling problems, time problems, so he won't be able to release that many videos at the moment, so I have to uh, do a little more, which is fine with me. So, what are we going to do in this part? I can tell you what we are going to do in this part. We are going to um, check the rest of this town. Well, did you just go inside the door? You did, didn't you? Okay, so we haven't been here, which is cool. Let's talk to him. You're not supposed to be here. What do you want? Who are you? I'm the supervisor of this refinery. What do you want? What is this place? This is the refinery of Broken Hills. This is where we purify the ore dug from the mine. What do you want? Uh, I want some uranium. Sorry. <coughs> That's ridiculous. We're not giving you any. Fine, bye. Okay, can we loot the lockers? We can. And again, it's the holy trinity of flare, crowbar, and a sledgehammer. How odd. What the hell is that? Dean's Electronics. Nice. You can always use these kind of books. Can we go inside or are we going to get in trouble? We're not going to get in trouble. Where did Hank go? Has anyone seen Hank? I don't know. Where is Hank? The mutants and humans seem to be on edge lately. Okay. Where did Hank? Okay, everybody's looking for Hank. Humans ain't all bad. That's nice of you to say. There's like a workbench here. Let's search that. And we got another wrench! God, how long have we been looking for a wrench? And now we are finally finding wrenches. Alright, so we are going to go... Um, did we talk to the doctor yet? I don't think we have, have we? Let's go talk to the doctor. No, come on. You cannot get there? Why not? Is somebody standing in my way? Oh, the door is not open. No, that makes sense. Hello, Weez. Hi there, I'm Doc Holiday. How can I help you? I'm hurt and need healing. Let me take a look at that. I can heal you, but it will cost. How much? I'll pay. Whatever. A hundred bucks. There you go. All better. One more thing. Okay, one of my friends is hurt and needs healing. Yeah, let's just heal him up. Cassidy. Yeah, I can heal this for a price. How much? Yeah, 50 bucks, I'll pay. Let's just heal up the party. One more thing. Sulik. How much? 50 bucks. All right, let's pay. One more thing. Tell me about the town. Let's see, I was born here years ago. Place was just getting started. I picked up when I was a teen and tooled around the place for a while. I met a woman, fell in love. She died of sickness. I decided then that I was going to become a doctor. Yeah, go on. Then I came back here and watched Marcus build a town from shanties. I remember from my youth into the sprawling metropolis you see before you. I saw people attracted by promises of wealth. I saw people grow up and die. I saw currents of history. So that means... That means that I don't know most of the new people these days. Most of my memories are just that. Memories. Thanks for the story. What do you want? Any gossip? You're, you would be surprised what people say when they're in pain. Like what? Oh god, the mouse is pissing me off. It's only in this game though. I don't know what's going on. Um, yeah, like what? Surprisingly little. Sorry, but when I'm concentrating on healing someone, I don't usually pay attention to their innermost secrets. Oh, will you answer more questions? No. What do you want? Any gossip? Okay. Mouse is pissing me off. Forget it, sorry. Okay, I guess you can't do anything more with him. You can search the place for books. If you push Salik out of the way. Alright, what do we have here? Nothing. 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 Can we... No, we can't. I was going to use the book. Let's just use the book now. 
because I will forget later. You learn a lot about repairing broken electronics. That sounds good. Do we have any other books? Uh, no, we don't. All right. It's dark already. Um, I want to go back up, but I'm going to rest till morning because I don't really like it when it's dark and um, I don't really like um, how the recording looks when it's dark. So there you go. Let's go back up to the mine that was um, where the purifier is, is dead. I just want to check something. Well, wow, there's so many places to, to look at here, but I don't really know if it's worth it or not. I mean, there are like so many houses, and I, I doubt that there is anything interesting in there, but I mean, we probably have to check them all out. Oh, what the hell? What is it you want? Out with it, I'm a busy man. Who are you, and what is with the scorpion? I'm the professor. What I do is applied intelligence testing. I create chemical pond co compounds to increase intelligence. I'm trying some out on this rat scorpion here. After my failure with a plant. You tried it out on a plant? Oh, that is so annoying. Um, yes, I have. Thank you very much. Are you ever hear of ment hats? I helped develop a method for easy mass production of that drug and others. Lots of others. Okay, you are a scientist. All right, all right. Say, I'd like to try out my skills against your scorpion. You wish to take a test, huh? Do you want to test your manual dexterity, your perception, or your intelligence? Let's test our agility. Very well. I'll be matching you against the scorpion. You will both attempt to unlock these boxes. Good, good luck. Oh my god. I gotta press the number two now. So the scorpion is gonna... <laughs> Okay, I don't have to do anything. Ooh, beat that, Mr. Exoskeleton. I won. <laughs> I'll, I'll let you pick a lock with claws. Chitter. Well, that was a tie. What, what do you mean that was a tie? I won, what the fuck? I got 500 experience points for that. That is actually pretty good. Uh, let's take another test. Oh. Right, you'll stand behind this rail you and the scorpion will tell me the letters. Okay, that's the intelligence test, is it? Let's test my eyes, or it's perception. Uh, we'll tell the letters you read from top to bottom, left to right. Got it, let's go. M O O M U. Uh, no, sorry. Uh, that's way off. <laughs> Correct, good boy. Good boy, your Morse code skills are improving nicely. What the hell? Scorpion knows, knows Morse code? Do we have any Mentats that we can take to raise our intelligence? Mentats were those, um, those tablets, right? Let me see, maybe later. I'll take one more test about my smarts. You and the scorpion will be playing a game of my own devising. I call it chess. Are you ready? Yep, I'm ready. <laughs> Checkmate. Click. What? You cheated. Don't be a sore loser. I lose again? What kind of fucking scorpion is that? Okay. Can I do the agility test again? Do I get XP again? I lost again? Is it like a luck thing? Can I try it more often? I mean, I could try... Let's try the, the, um, the seeing test again. You lose Scorpion 4, Barani 1. What the... Well, you're keeping score? You asshole. Let's take the eyes test again. Oh, see, it worked. That's correct. That's some nice experience. So let's try the last one. See if we can can do the last one too. We're not that dumb, are we? How dumb are we? Six. We're we're like decent. Um, test smarts, chess. Oh, fuck you. No, you're not. 
You cheated again. Okay, let's try one more time. Just for fun. Oh, okay. Uh, let's try that again when we find some uh, mentats. All right, that was that was fun though. I right, like that. Mastermind Scorpion. All right, that was interesting. Maybe we should check all the other houses. Oh, there's some lockers in there. Look at that. Oh, there's this mutant in there too. Let's see what he has to say. I think that the raid and gas keeps the miners young or, or dead. Well, if they die, they never age. Okay, let's search the lockers. We got a leather jacket. That's probably going to get us some money. I have the feeling that that uh, money is is uh, not a a problem of having assets anymore. It's more of a problem. Um, fuck you, Sulik. It's more a matter of <clears throat> finding people that you can sell it to. Okay. No. <laughs> Open the damn door. God, man, these walls. There we go. Another desk. We haven't had to uh, lockpick in a long time. Okay, I'm going to take the fruit because um, somebody in the comments said a couple of parts ago that the fruit will come into play later. All right, so we check that house. Let's check the small one. There's some dude in there. Let's talk to him. Hello, friend. I can't believe that son of a bitch. What do you mean? Okay, he's worried about the NCR. I remember the NCR from Fallout New Vegas. I don't... I, I don't know if I finished that game. I, I played it for like, I don't know, like 50%. And then um, I watched a Let's Play of it like a couple of years ago. So I don't really know. I don't remember the NCR being that bad. I mean, they're a military, of course. Um, but I don't have really any... I can't really recall if they're like really bad. Yeah, I got a dresser. There's nothing in there. I remember the the like the Brotherhood of Steel and and um, that they were like dicks, but uh, NCR or Caesar's Legion though is that like a manhole? Oh, what's down there? Oh, look at that! What the hell is this place? Full of ants. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder what's down here. Some water, more ants. There's like nothing special here, is there? Oh, we're getting attacked by an ant. There's a ladder that goes up. Maybe we should take one of those. Oh, there, there's an ant right there. Let's switch our... These shouldn't be a problem. No, they're like one shot. I don't know. Let's go to one of the ladders, see what happens. Why not? I gotta reload soon. It's not dead. I mean, these do give, like, okay experience points, especially if we don't get hit. Salik, it was hit for 40 points, you dumbass, and your... your gun. Okay, let's... Um... Okay, it looks like... Uh, they're, like, diminishing returns. Oh, was that the word? Because it gave like 50, okay, it gives 50 experience points all the time when we not when we don't get hurt. Sounds like a good deal. <clears throat> Pro 
probably get like a thousand points just for just in here. Yeah, it gives 50, 50 points all the time. That's pretty good. So let's just work through this place. It's definitely easier than the dam. Oh, that was a nice shot. So do we get 100 now? Yeah, we get 100 because we killed two. Good to know, good to know. Found two. Owning. Um, how many experience points do we need for the next level up? 10,000, wow, that's quite a lot. That's quite a lot. Let's go to the first ladder. Where is the first ladder? It's right there. Let's go to that ladder. Okay, that's good. It's coming right around the corner. Can I hit that? No. Let's go to the straight right here. Wait for them to come. Of course, Sulik and uh, Cassidy ain't, aren't doing anything, as usual. We're gonna get attacked. We're gonna get attacked. Yes, I knew there was one. The, the blow knocks of knocks of our feet. That little bastard ant. Can't believe it. Oops. There we go. More ants. And we're about to reach the first ladder. And that was good. One shot, one kill. Weak ass ants. Okay, let's kill that one. Nice. Oh, okay. Um, is there anything to loot here? I mean, it's kind of hard to see. Yeah, if you were 20 years younger. Whatever, Cassidy. Okay, let's see what's up there. Oh, we're here. Okay. And there's that poisoned mine. Let's go down again. Let's take the other ladder. See where that leads us. Where was that? Oh, what the hell is that? That looks like a like a place you can go inside. I use some dynamite on that. Looks interesting. I I think I I uh, turned up the combat speed a little bit. I think I thought that was um, a good idea. No. Kill it and kill the other one too, please. Nice. Oh, there's another one up there. Look at that. Nice. Oh, you're still alive. There you go. Okay, let's see if we can blow that up, man. That looks like something you could blow up. Cave wall. Right? Doesn't it? I mean, there's even like a, um... Let's put some dynamite there, just in case. And then we're gonna clear the rest of the cave while we wait for it to explode. Okay. Let's put it on two minutes. All right. There we go. Let's go guys, let's go, and let's kill the rest of these ants here, there's one right there, oh we got, oh there are a lot here, let's reload first, was killed, nice, nice, okay, 
Let's kill that one too. Okay, we get experience points. 150. Is there anything to loot here? Or is this cave like pretty useless? Or is this the mine? No, this is not the mine, right? <clears throat> Wasn't there like another ladder? Somewhere? Oh, there's another ant, that's for sure. That's the ladder. That's the ladder we, where we came from, and that's a different one. Okay, let's try that one. Kill both of these. And was killed. Man, I wonder how much XP we actually get when we clear out that Wanamingo mine. That's probably gonna be quite a lot. Alright. Come on, there we go. Oh, there's another ant here. Oh, there are three ants here. Uh. I'm glad my f my followers are doing nothing. <clears throat> Can we hit it? Yeah. You need four action points. That seems a little over the top. Nice, all right. Oh, what the hell? Why does that lead ladder lead into your house? <laughs> that is weird. Why do you have a why do you have something like that leading into your house? A simple rug. The weaver was obvious obviously very you can't go down here anymore. Oh, that was weird. That was very weird. Okay. Let's go see what our dynamite did. <laughs> Probably nothing. Did it even, ex has it even exploded yet? There we go. Okay, that did absolutely nothing. Okay, that's good to know. Waste of time. Still wonder what that cave was was for. The mountain wall looks very inaccessible. Okay. That looks like a hole in the mountain. She could go for a smoke. What do you mean, hey pal, over here? Is that the plant? Oh, that's the intelligent plant! Hi, nice weather we're having, huh? Are you connected with that scientist in any way? Oh yes, uh, the professor. Uh, he grew up. He grew up. He grew me from a tiny spore and nurtured me, but I realized from an early age that if I were to act as smart as I truly am, he would cut me into pieces to examine me. So I played dumb and got planted out here. It's nice, but I'd like to branch out a little. You know, maybe get planted someplace else? Right. What do you want? I'm looking for a better place to be. Right here is nice and all, but frankly, these plans aren't much for conversation. I was thinking over there by the building with all the ghouls in it. Would you replant me? <laughs> sure. Delightful. I am very, very pleased. Just find yourself a shovel and come, come on back when you're done. Maybe I can tell you a secret, my friend. I do hope you continue to flower. Uh, yeah, right, so long. Do we have a sho sh uh, shovel? We should have a shovel. At least one of us has a shovel. It doesn't seem like I have a shovel in my inventory. Or Salik. Salik. What you be needing? Let me see if you've got a shovel. You've got a sledgehammer. Of course you do. That's your favorite weapon. Okay, you don't have a shovel. Maybe I put a shovel in the trunk. Maybe. So where is Cassidy? I can't see, man. 
There he is. I think that's What's him, up? right? You got yeah. that. <laughs> you got... You don't have a shovel. Mm, I probably have a shovel in my trunk. Okay. That's it for now. So I want to check out that mine again. I mean, there's gas in the mine and we're probably going to die. I just want to check it out. Look at it a little bit. What the hell? That's, that looks like a, like a death claw. Okay, that's probably the thing that's broken. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Okay. So we still need that air purifier. What is that? Okay. Let us uh, go to the car and see if we have a shovel in the trunk. Can't believe, picked up so many shovels. Can't believe I don't have any shovels left. And then we've, if we have time, if we don't have a shovel, we're gonna talk to the, the caravan people. And if we, um, who the hell are you? Hey there, friend. Haven't seen any jewels or precious metals lying around anywhere, have you? Uh, not today. If I run across any, I'll let you know. What's your name? Me, I'm Mickey, Swave, and debonair treasure hunter of Broken Hills. Treasure hunter? Don't tell me you haven't heard of me. You've never been told of the tales of the fast Mickey, of his running gun battles, of his running gun battles, two-fisted two action, and pernicious plunderings? I'm afraid I've never had the pleasure. Well, you're missing out, friend. One of these days I'll have to fill you in on the glory, gory details. <laughs> I'll be waiting with the bated breath. So any riches you need tracked down? I'm the best of the best. No, not today. If I come across, I'll let you know. Oh well, I guess I shouldn't be surprised. The market for treasure hunters has really dropped in recent years. The whole death and famine and fight for survival thing really hurts people's sense of adventure. Keep me in mind, though, if anything comes up. You will be the first on my list. Okay. Check that trunk. Shovel. We've got a bunch of weapons and no fucking shovel. Can't believe it. Let's see if the general store has one. Hello, good lady. You have armor, you have money, ropes, but no shovel. Okay, no shovel for us. Um, so I might have to like look for a shovel uh, somewhere else, maybe uh, later. Let's check out this place. Hello, friends. Help you. Yeah, I'm looking for the caravan master. In that case, you want to talk to Bill, the outfitter of Broken Hills. He's inside that building over there. I have some questions. Who are you? Me? I'm Darren. I'm a guard for Bill's caravans. Anything else? No. Bye. All right. All right. Who are you? Uh, me? I'm Stark. I'm a guard for Bill's caravans. Anything else? No. Okay. They all say the same thing. I don't know if it's worth talking. Who are you? I'm Urs, okay. Ursula. You look different. Can I help you something? With something. Who are you? I'm Max, one of the caravan guards. Okay, okay, okay. You're all the same. That's just like a stable. Let's talk to... What the hell is that? Come on. Howdy, pard. What can I do for you? I need to buy stuff. Yeah, what do you want to buy? Oh, look, he's got three shovels. And he's got a shotgun. He's got ammo, he's got money. Let's sell some crap. I don't know, do we need this, those tools? We have enough flares, we have enough crowbars. We don't need the damn sledgehammer. 
Don't need that. Uh, the rest you can use, I guess. Oh, what? Oh, that's five millimeter. Whoa, I'm taking all of that. Definitely, so we can get an assault rifle. That's awesome. Um, and a shovel. Nice, you got some. I wonder if he restocks. That would be awesome. Because if he restocks. Um, yeah, I'll take that. If he restocks, I might stock up on ammo. Alright, that was interesting. Now we got a shovel. Let's finish the flower quest. Um, and after we, fuck you, Sonic. And after we finish the flower quest, I'm gonna end the part. All right, let's put on the shovel. Gotta, oh, sorry. Still gotta check if that, um, if uh, the metal armor and, and crap is uh, better than than the armors we are wearing right now. Oh yeah, and Tozi said we can actually get Marcus as a follower if we do some quests for him. I don't know if we need him as a follower, but uh, the way Cassidy is uh, playing at the moment, there's a good chance that I will replace him in the future. All right, buddy. You're gonna replant you. Oh, friend, don't just start digging. We've got to strategize the move first. Let's talk it over. My friend, has the sun been shining upon you? How does your day flower? Are you ready for the move? I certainly am. Let's go. I'm so excited. I could re release a spore cloud all over myself. Let's go. Oh, no, please, keep your, keep your spores to yourself. Ooh, the soil here feels so different, cleaner somehow, probably because I don't have to share it with those other plants. Ah, uh, oh yes, if you ever run across the professor and a scorpion, remember this chess maneuver. It's called the flying liver attack and the scorpion cannot stand, ag cannot stand against it. Oh, that's awesome, that is, thanks for the secret. You got 1000 experience points. Let's go to the professor and beat that asshole of a scorpion. Where was he? He's right there. I can hear the scorpion click clacking. Right, that was here, right? Yeah. I want to take one of your tests, Professor. I want to play chess. Yes, I'm ready. Come on, get his liver. And checkmate. Yes. Oh, the scorpion is attacking me? Are you kidding me, scorpion? Oh, that was one shot. <laughs> The professor is hostile too? Okay, better get out of the way before... Okay, I don't know if this is a good thing or not. What are you doing, Salik? Did you just... Is he running away? I hope it's not the whole town that went hostile on us now. Because I didn't save. Alright. Sorry, Professor. Oh, he's got ment hats. Nice. That was some nice um nice loot there. <laughs> Spectacles. He was using tools. Okay, you can ski keep your tail. Is there anything in these boxes? Do I have to lockpick them? Okay, won't work. All right. Um, so that was a very interesting part. <laughs> if you ask me. Did a lot of stuff. Is that the tail? Oh, it's a rock. Did something f throw a fucking rock in his face? Oh, Sulik, you bastard. Oh, look at that. There's some stuff here. It's locked, but we are a master lockpick. 
Okay, something seems different about this lock. That's weird. This one works. No books. Can we wear the spectacles or can we trade them in or something? Oh yeah, I'll take that. Alright, that was a good part. Um, so I'll see you guys in the next part where we do whatever. I don't know yet. If you have any suggestions on what to do next, please post in the comments. See you guys next time. Goodbye.